To properly fit, first place the tip of the cane against the side of the foot. The top of the cane should be about wrist height, so this is too high. Make the adjustment and try again. Oops, it's now too low. It's not at wrist height and the elbow should never be straight while holding the cane. Keep adjusting until you get it correct. Now it is at wrist height with a slight bend in the elbow. Perfect. The optimal way to use a cane is to place it in the opposite hand of the weak or involved side. In this case, his left lower extremity is involved. To practice the correct pattern, stand still and move the cane and the involved side together. When you dance, you move with your partner. The cane and the involved side are partners, so they always have to move together. 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 Note that the angle of his leg and the cane are the same. This is correct. This is not correct. The cane is now on the same side as the involved side. This is also not correct. The cane is the correct hand, but it is not moving together with the involved left side. Again, not correct. The angle of the cane and the angle of its involved side should be the same. Going up the steps one step at a time, step up with the uninvolved side first followed by the involved side and cane together. Always remember to hold the rail. Going up the steps reciprocally simply keeping the cane on the same step as the involved side. Remember, they always go together. When coming down the steps, step down with the involved side and the cane first, then followed by the uninvolved side. If done reciprocally, simply keep the cane on the same step as the involved side. Remember to always hold the rail. Thank you.